like, oh, spring's here, I saw a rabbit. They're usually always here. You just don't really see them because they think they act funny. One of my favorites. You know what that one is?
I'm just gonna show you this one. This is so good. It's really a small shot. Our backyard. Look at how you just posed for me. And I mean, literally, I saw it and it was about, I wanna say, I had him in my frame for maybe a minute. That's it. Just one minute, just sitting there in the snow. So probably one of my favorite trips this year was... What lens do you use the most? I just use really one. I use a 150, 600 millimeter Tamron lens with a Canon 80D EOS. And the other question I get is, what millimeter do you usually, 600? I'm always, because pretty much all of my subjects are far away, so I always usually have it out. But yeah, I um, actually fell in love with one of, I fell in love with someone's pictures, is what happened. And that was in 2020? No, 19. No, it was in 2020. Yeah, because I literally got my camera like a few weeks before the whole world fell apart. Mm-hmm. You know, before COVID happened. I literally had it in my hands like three weeks before. Mm-hmm. And my husband had said to me, he's like, Dave, because he knew I was like getting into birds. Figure out what one to get. And just get it. So I connected with someone, and that someone just kind of helped me, and that's what happened too. So in that journey, you know, I've taken a lot of pictures, and it just, it's kind of nice to go somewhere and not just take pictures of, of just things. It's, you know, looking for things, searching for birds, you know. So one of my favorite trips, I just want to say, and then I think that will be it. Unless I just talk about, yeah. I mean, we have, I know, the American Goldfinch. (laughs) You guys always see this one in your yards. So that was also the sunflower field. Okay, so one of my favorite absolute trips that I took this year was with Jamie. (laughs) So um, there is a place called Machia Seal Island, which is an hour off the coast of Maine. Do you know where Lubeck, Maine is? Okay. So a lot of people don't know where Lubeck is, and I always tell them, well, you're going to find out. So Lubeck, Maine is the farthest most northeastern part in the United States. So New Brunswick, Canada is going to be right across the border. So we drove maybe 20 minutes. 20, we stayed in Lubeck. We drove maybe 20 minutes down to leave the Cutler Bay to go an hour out into the ocean to get dropped off on Machia Seal Island and you had the honor of hanging out in bird blinds for like an hour, hour and a half. But it was to see these guys. They're so cute. So the Atlantic Puffin, they're adorable. So many people go to like Newfoundland, they'll go to Iceland, they'll go really, really far away. Okay, I mean, my trip was 10 hours, too, to get up there. But um, the, this is what I wanted. So this is part of the mating process. So when they mate, similar to the cardinals, when they mate, they will say, hey, I'm interested. <laughs> and another interesting factor, and I was told this before, is that there's always one that watches. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> And 
And um, the other noteworthy thing is that I was able to score two tickets for two trips out. And it was quite an awesome thing. But usually when you go on like a puffin watch or a whale watch or something, they'll just take you around the island. This was different because you actually got off the boat and you were escorted, mind you, escorted to the blind. You were not to leave the blind at all. If you left the blind, you're done. It's like you have to go back to the ship. So you, we stayed in there every minute. <laughs> you just keep shooting and shooting and shooting and some of them were from me to you. They were like five feet away, so I would just use my camera and, you know, so it was an awesome experience. I have to say there were only 15 people allowed to go every day out to this island. And on the second day, I think there was a couple people who were really dressed up. And we're, we saw, and we're just like, because you're, you're poop everywhere. Okay, I mean, it's nothing to dress up for. You, you don't need and we and I knew that they were not going to stay in those bird blinds long. No. Yeah, they were gone. Like they're in there for maybe like twenty. I mean, people who are not into birding, you're not going to sit patiently because you. Yeah, yeah. So that was an awesome experience, though. So another little noteworthy thing, and probably my last thing. So from this trip that I went to, I um, came back to camp, and I was like. I gotta send my picture, or I gotta send my husband a really good picture. Okay? Like, I send my husband a really good picture all the time. <laughs> but I don't really get like a response too much, right? <laughs> so I was like, I gotta send him a really good one. So I sent this to him, and the response was, holy S H I T. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay, that's awesome. <laughs> so after that, when I got back to reality and work, I had a couple people that were like, Chris. You really should put something in like the month of William's art show. I entered something like this last year. It didn't get it. And I was like, are you kidding me? This is rare. This is such a hard shot. They're obviously not bird lovers. They don't. Yeah. So I put this in, it got accepted and it sold. Mm. And I was like, that's awesome. <laughs> it didn't, okay, it, I, I didn't get rich off of it, that's no, not it. But it was all the honor of just like, yay, someone else appreciated my work. And I don't know whose wallet's on. <laughs> but yeah, so anyways, I have um, any of these. They're, you can buy them if you'd like one. I have photo cards available. They're $5 each or three cards for 12 I have a ton in here of like different ones, like barred owls and stuff that you don't even see up there. But these make great gifts too. And I have calendars too. Mm -hmm. So I hope you guys enjoyed my first.
most covers have a foot oh pocket. Right here. Yeah. This didn't, so I was like, I gotta buy it. Back. Yeah, it's just <laughs> often the po- if there's a pocket up there that shrinks funny, yeah. Yeah. it just oh, shakes your whole shirt. Yeah. There should be a job. Hello, how are you? I am. I am. I Thank you. 